Hi, welcome to this tutorial about Antergos open box in specific. So we followed the steps described on ericdubois.be to install Antergos. And we have about six uh, desktops I think we have to uh, choose from. And I've made a tutorial of each one of them, how to customize them. Uh, but installation is pretty much the same. It's just one desktop option. You click or you don't click. So we've now installed Openbox and let's go and go for full screen mode. First thing we see is this uh, conky here. Maybe you're wondering um, what we can do with this conky. How will we change it? Where is it? Where is my menu? There is no menu. There is this thing at the top here and with a right mouse click I get this menu everywhere anywhere everywhere maybe not here not here because that's the plank but for the rest everywhere not here because there's a conky but this is called tint and and in tint you can uh, program some stuff so there are icons in there but i can't get to a file with a start and a menu so it's not there it's the right mouse click and everything should be done with this right mouse click places browse here the desktop Documents, downloads, it must be somewhere in here. So let's take a look. We see that it's, this is the new mix icon team that is selected. And uh, we're gonna find Ctrl H if we find something about this conky here. We see config file, we see. Normally we should have a config dot conky so that's where it should be but here we see another word conky dot conf it has something about the date cpu ram let's open it libreoffice is not a good choice my dear friends so let's make him a bit more aware of the world around him bit too big for my taste no don't want the recovery right mouse click open with let's go for mouse pads probably in accessoires select default action for this file type better you see here that this is actually the conky it's in here the time is in here the cpu the ram is in here so anything you want to uh, change is in here it's nice to see that we have also a content.com file here that's a program content is a program to change your uh, appearance so the shadow the opacity the fading dimming and all that can be set in here so that's interesting to know but it's not uh, important as of yet so main thing first so i'm gonna cut these uh, tutorials in little parts how to get rid of this and get our own conky so you can edit this little file to anything you like but i would like to get my own conky from the net so i'm gonna to go into internet i'm finding firefox firefox is opening and then i'm gonna go to this here and i'm gonna say keep in dock it's already no it's not now it's keep in dock I'm moving it if I can to the front and then all tap there is my Firefox again maximizing double clicking yes it works I'm going to get to my github you know that I like to work with scripts scripts are nothing more than a way to find out um, a way or two to make my work easy instead of typing everything I just put it in a file and run this file that makes my life easier so what we're having is this what we want to go and arrive at is more or less this and let's have some fun okay now I should be able to get back to my files so right mouse click applications back to my files how should I get to my files depending on the software that's installed let's take a quick look so you know what's installed as well natively without my uh, scripts 
these programs have been installed and we're looking for a file manager and this is a file manager PC man FM FM file manager and I'm gonna put this one as well in the dock because we are needed always Firefox and a file manager Control H she understands to hide files as well folder data right mouse click can we open a terminal in here we're not capable of opening a terminal so that's a bit sad really because let's see if Control alt t works no shortcut yet so okay we have to fix that as well can we open a terminal applications accessories no system tools yep this is a terminal this is a terminal let's take one of those now I should ask him where am I actually so I'm gonna cd to data ls and here I'm gonna git clone what I hope I still have paste yes the antergos open box scripts we should not close it otherwise I'll, I have an, again a problem so we have antergos open box we should go into CD installation. Um, sorry, CD Antergos is better. Like so, and then CD installation, like so, and then this is all the scripts. These are all these things here. The question is what do we need to run and what shall we not run and all that. But I just wanted to fix one thing now. So, one by one, I'm gonna change my open box not using big scripts conky aureola is the one i want to have so i'm gonna install conky aureola and that's that where is conky aureola it's in control h hidden folder here i'm gonna install the acres right mouse click does not work really need to fix that one so cd my home folder and now aureola acres ls so i'm in here this is the same as this in terminal and i'm gonna install the conky he's killing every conky available so also the conky from the system here and there you see i have now my own conky on the system here and let's quit this here and go to well i have to open another terminal again because of the logo i want to change the logo it's a bit strange that the logo is this is not my conky conf this is another conky conf as you'll see this is the conky conf that was used to be used to to work i we have to fix that too um, so, applications, system tools, LX terminal. The conky you're looking at is actually running in the .config conky file ls. It's here, and what we want to change is a file. So it's in the config conky. And we want this one, the colors are okay. We're just going to change Linux Mint into open box. Save. That's that. We are happy as, uh, as can be. We have our own Aureola Acres. But, but the question is, do I explain it now or later? If I want to round it up, I should do it now. Auto start, it's going to start a conky here, which is called conky conf. It's, so it's the wrong directory. It's not this one I want to start. So what I'm gonna do is just tell him, start your conky, like so. And then he'll start this one. So that's fixed as well. Control S, saved. And when we restart, then this one will be restarted 
let's round up this tutorial and tackle another issue in another tutorial.